Okay. Okay, this is Sunday morning. We're in the kiddie pool. And it just so happens that we happen to be by ourselves. There's Jim from Project Healing Waters, one of the participants. And that's the tail end down there. Swing it around. There's one of the little side feeder channels back in there. And we're by ourselves. Uh, the map that we're looking at here is the Game and Fish map. Uh, the, the large blue circle, almost in the center of that photo, is the kitty hole of the kitty pool, however you want want to call it. And you look above it, and you see all those little braided channels with blue dots on them. Well, those are also in stream improvement uh, projects that have really helped the river. The Texas Hole parking lot is the lower left-hand side of the um, of that photo right here, right there. And the current comes from our right to our left. North is directly above us in the canyon section. Okay, this is a diagram that I used to give my uh, students when they would do my workshops. The current is coming from our right to left. You see those stars there? Well, that's what I would recommend the people uh, or the anglers to, to fish according to the current and, and what the fish are doing at the time. Right through the center of the kiddie pool, right there, you see, find, you'll see some boulders there. They're, they're there. They're not going to be moving. And they give you a good indicator of what uh, you're going to be fishing. On the bottom end of this diagram, you have the arroyo, which is an access point, that little trail, which is another access point above the word kiddie pool. And then you have the oxbow that comes into the top of the pool there. Uh, we'll be taking a look at some photos of some guys fishing the upper section, then we'll move on to the, uh, the lower section of the this run. Hey, look, at least you're not going down. Put your net? No. Is that empatados? Let me know if you need help, okay? Here's another part of that diagram that I give my students here. Here we see the the lower end of the upper part of the kiddie pool run there. You can see the feeder stream as it comes through there off of that little strip of island or that little strip of land there. Those stars right there are the areas that I would recommend to fish. And the current will be going from the right to the left again. And I'll be fishing upstream into that current. Also where that feeder stream meets, uh, the main current is a pretty good area to fish all the way into that uh, the mouth of that feeder stream uh, right there. Anyway, here's some more photos of people fishing this exact same spot. Here's the, um, the bottom half of that diagram that I've uh, that I give out my students here. Here's uh, the kiddie pool, and this is the the southern end of that. 
You can see the access point, which is just a little trail through the, the, the toolies there. You can see the oxbow there on the bottom right. The stars again are be will be areas that I recommend to fish. And of course, if the current's going from right to left, you'll be fishing upstream into that current. And these bowls right here will be hold a lot of fish too. And we hear some more stills and videos of the guys uh, catching fish. What number is this for you? Uh, seven, I think. Cool. 